everybody, welcome back. Today is update number five. Today's the day. We're on day 18. So today we are unplugging our egg turner. We're pulling out the eggs to, so we can remove the egg turner. Then we're putting our eggs back in, just laying them down on the metal grid that's in here, which I will show you. And we're basically putting the incubator on lockdown. We're gonna fill it with water, we're gonna close it up, let it get back to temp, and hopefully within three to possibly four days, we're gonna have some peeping and some chicks peeping through. First, just a little update on incubating and hatching eggs. So the day you start your incubator and you put your fertile, hopefully fertile, chicken eggs in, if you put them in in the morning and they go all day in the incubator, that would count as day one. If you put them in late in the afternoon, you would wait till the following day to count that as day one. They need 24 hours in the incubator to be considered one day when you're first starting. So hopefully that helps you guys. So now let's come on in and start explaining what we're gonna do. What we're gonna do first, I grabbed a plastic tote and I'm gonna throw just an old towel in the dryer to warm it up. This is gonna serve as an area to lay my eggs in while I'm taking them out of the egg turner so I can get the egg turner out of there. So I definitely recommend heating up a towel so your eggs stay nice and warm. So give me a few minutes, I'm gonna go do that, and then we're gonna come back and I'm gonna show you how to get the eggs out of there. Okay, I got my nice warm towel. Next, you wanna unplug your egg turner, which I got under the table, it's done. Now it's time to remove all of these eggs as quickly and as gently as you can. Remember, we might have some baby chicks in those eggs. Okay, helper. Go ahead and lift it all the way up, pretty girl. Hold it up. All right. So as gentle and as quickly as we can, these eggs are super nice and warm. like the little giant egg turner we're gonna pull it out Emily can you lift up the lid a little bit sweetie definitely helps if you've got two people to help here's the wire grid I was telling you guys about so you want to fill up your moats with water I usually do a warm not cold not super hot but a warm water fill it to the top because this is it we're going on lockdown guys okay go ahead and step back Ali all right, and here's what you're gonna do. Doesn't matter how you lay them, you're just gonna lay them. And actually, let's go ahead and candle one of these too while we're doing this, guys. Okay, so as we're putting them in, I'm just gonna check a couple, and I don't know if you guys can see that, but this egg is completely full. We've got the light in the bottom, which is what you wanna see. Otherwise, this is consumed by an embryo in there that it's in a few days hopefully gonna come out as a chick you guys so let's do another one Allie real fast yep same way so we've got a lot of fertile eggs all right I'm gonna start putting these in in here lay them down it doesn't matter which way you lay them because if these chicks are gonna hatch these eggs will actually start moving here in a couple of a couple of days and they will start kind of peeping their way through so we filled the moat 
Eggs look great. Let's get this lid on. And now you guys want to keep this sealed. We've got plenty of water in there. The eggs look good. We don't touch this at all. Okay, so things you want to look for on hatch day. Since these are standard hens, they usually take 21 days. If you are doing bantam eggs, because they're a smaller egg, they tend to hatch at a faster rate. So usually day 18, day 19, you're seeing those guys starting to peep through. Now, if day 21 comes and there's not a lot of activity going, usually you can give it a few more days. So I say by day 25, if you don't have anything going on, your chicks are most likely not gonna hatch. Like I said, today's day 18. We've got three days to go, you guys. I'm excited, we're excited. And if we start hearing some peeps or seeing some peeps, we're gonna come back with the camera as best as we can without opening this. Cause remember, it's on lockdown and we're gonna check it out. All right guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. And hopefully next time I see you, we got some baby chicks. Have a nice day, you guys.